And the fishing rods are these oversized fishing poles with hooks that rest along the Water Street Bridge. They were introduced a couple of years ago during the kickoff of the Ebb and Flow River Walk. And now they're receiving additional attention for some unexpected add-ons that went up sometime before dawn. I was disappointed. Um, it wasn't the artist's work. The artist's work was being vandalized. The fishing rods were introduced to the San Lorenzo River Walk along with other works of art in 2015. The idea was to use the art to create a more enjoyable atmosphere around the San Lorenzo River. This art is just a powerful part of um, piquing interest in the River Walk and making it a regular part of our daily lives. But someone attached five foot long objects fashioned in the shape of hypodermic syringes in what some believe is an effort to bring attention to the problem of discarded needles. Just down the street, 10 syringes were discovered at this bus depot less than 20 feet from the red bin clearly marked for disposal of needles. Take Back Santa Cruz has been proactive in bringing the needle problem to light, but founder Annalisha Cube says her group is not behind it and doesn't condone it. We cannot condone defacing art in any manner in our city. It's not okay. The big question is, was a criminal act done to this public art work? The city seems to think so. It is disrespectful to alter or vandalize another artist's artwork. It didn't take city park rangers long to reel in all six pieces from the Water Street Bridge. It would be great to really articulate what that concern is so that we could actually respond to it as opposed to just speculation of where they're coming from and what they're asking for. And we reached out to the original artist, Timory Gordon, to get her feelings about the prank or vandalism, but she was out of town. Erin? All right, Phil, thank you. The city is planning on filing a police report seeking vandalism charges, but that could be difficult to prove since the giant syringe display has is easily removed.